Hello people, welcome back. In this video, I'm going to talk about Adobe Spark Post. It is an intro video where I'm going to explain you what does Adobe Spark Post actually do. Adobe Spark Post is a part of Adobe Spark which contains three apps and these apps are web and iOS apps. The Android apps are yet to come and that include Adobe Spark video, Adobe Spark Post, and Adobe Spark Page. And the Adobe Spark Post is used to create images. What do I mean by creating images? Yes, it's true. It's used to create images even though if you don't have any image. Which means that actually in the photo editing app what we do is that we use, we add effects and we increase or decrease the saturation and we will then save that image but here even though if you don't have image you can just create an image by adding a simple text with a solid color in the background not only that you can also use patterns in the background or you can also use image Adobe Spark Post is a very easy to use tool so if a person who wants to just create wonderful book covers within seconds then he can use Adobe Spark Post to create that and it's true so we have got a lot uh, so many fonts with the Adobe Spark Post and not only that you can add more than one font type within a single text you can add more than one photo but you cannot merge one photo with the other you can add more than one photo and create a photo colleague you have got a uh, ready-made sizes ready-made sizes what do i mean by that ready-made sizes mean that you can just select a particular size saying instagram post saying youtube thumbnail and when you select this size it will create a canvas for you which is actually of the size of the option that you have selected suppose if you just click on the option called YouTube thumbnail then it will open a canvas of a size uh, which is recommended for the YouTube thumbnail and you can create one image and after you have saved this image you can resize it to any other size options available there so apart from this you have got a wonderful option called shapes which you can add in the background of the text that you have you have added and it makes your text more beautiful and there are a lot more customization options available there with the Adobe Spark Post and you can publish this image that you have created with Adobe Spark Post as, as an URL or you, or you can just send it right to the social apps that are present within your within your iOS device or your MacBook or your PC and not only that you can publish it as a URL and save that image sorry I have said that earlier okay sorry if you found this video helpful please do share this video and be sure to subscribe see you bye bye